second sequel of Hein the Clumsy Death. The first mistake Hein makes is tripping over his cloak and making a huge amount of noise that makes every construction worker wary, because a noise of unknown origin means intruders on the construction site and that means thieves. They all look past Hein searchingly, except for one construction worker, a road worker who doesn't know where to look. Hein has no weapons with him but flies towards him, that must be George, he flies through the construction workers as if they are nothing more than air. They all feel the cold as he flies towards George with purpose. George asks and screams for help but they all look at him like he is crazy. That's the attention who just can't use Hein right now who says a must also say B. Anyone who starts something has to finish it, literally this time. About the same as eating vegetables you may say you do it but only have an eye for the meat. But whoever says a must also say B and not words but deeds so eat those vegetables. In this way Hein flies towards George who does not know how to give himself an attitude and throws wildly with vowels and tiles at Hein that go right through him. It's a new neighborhood and the construction workers are installing a water drain and drain pipe on the balcony, he can use that. So to keep the peace, he flies up to the balcony and hides. Did I mention this was a clumsy death? Well I wasn't kidding because while the construction workers place the downspout in the water drain, Hein gets sucked into the downspout and fires out like a cannon causing him to bounce like a cannonball in a pinball machine all over the construction site. Yeah that wasn't so smart was it? And as he bounces from wall to wall and from house to house he ends up in the cement mixer of the masons who grind it together with the cement and he is stuck in a huge mound of cement which is dumped on the back of a truck. He sees the construction site moving further and further away from him until the construction site is out of sight as the truck drives away. That wasn't smart at all. Then he wakes up and the day starts all over again without remembering anything but he has never woken up so dizzy. Hein, Hein, Hein you never learn. When will it become clear that you can't just do everything you want if you have the power or means? Hein is like so many children who don't listen and just stubborn and stubborn to his own thing. But what his teacher tried to make clear is that even the most inexperienced mower can mow and unfortunately his teacher looks back on that sadly because he sees everything Hein does and sometimes even his teacher gets a smile on his mouth from the mistakes Hein makes. But will he ever figure out how to mow quietly and unobtrusively? Because the fish and the old man also succeeded but when there is no help or trust nobody can do anything as it should because only with trust in each other and respect for each other everyone can get everything done. All he needs is a helping hand in the right direction, but will he get it? You'll find out tomorrow, sleep tight.